Hi, I'm Keith Esserick, I'm with the Care Start Sound. I'm Trent Hummel, I'm a pediatric neuro-oncologist at Cincinnati Children's Hospital and a board member of the Care Starts Now. Tell us a little bit about what is medulloblastoma, if you don't mind. So medulloblastoma is, first and foremost, a brain cancer. It usually starts as a tumor in your brain or as a tumor in your spine. Most of them in your, are in your brain, in the back part of your brain called the posterior fossa. Now, by far, the vast majority of medulloblastomas start in kids. There are a few cases throughout the year that uh, do occur in adults. Okay. But by far, what we're talking about with medulloblastoma are pediatric, a pediatric brain cancer. Now, do we normally find it just in, you know, I know you said it's within the brain, but do we normally find that it's outside of that sometimes, the diagnosis, or not? So, most times, it's isolated to the brain or to the spinal cord. Very rarely will it metastasize or become malignant and move to bones or elsewhere in the body. But for the most part, medioblastoma is located in the brain and can spread within what we call the central nervous system or the CNS. Uh, but to be clear, it is a central nervous system tumor and it is very rare to spread outside that central nervous system. What makes it different than other types of uh, brain cancers? Well, what makes it different is the, the research that we've got going on right now is that we've, and we'll talk a little bit, we'll talk more about this later, but there are different um, genetic components of medioblastoma that we break down uh, individual medulloblastoma into subgroups and there are four different subgroups and we'll talk about that later but the main thing that makes it different than other types of malignant or aggressive tumors because medulloblastoma make no mistake is a malignant and aggressive tumor is that it is treatable it's very treatable we have it's treatable with basically surgery radiation and chemotherapy and we can talk about that later as well but that's the, the biggest thing that, that separates it from other types of malignant brain tumors. 